and welcome to episode six of Soul Alchemy TV. I'm Susie, your host, and on today's episode, we are going to be pulling a card for a little bit of guidance and inspiration, having a little bit of a chit chat about what's coming up for my clients at the moment and what needs to be healed. And then I'm going to take you through a fragmented soul activation. So let's pull a card for this week to see just what we need to know, what messages are coming through for us. So I use these cards regularly with my guide. So just shuffling them to see what we need to know. And we have nature spirits. So the nature spirits are elves, fairies, and rock formations. So everywhere, there are nature spirits and you can connect with them, even in urban areas. These beings, elementals, want to be connected with and they can bring in so much positivity into your life. They help to relieve stress, tension. By connecting with nature spirits, we are really connecting with Mother Earth and all the wisdom and the energy and the healing and the nurturing that she has available for us. It takes our mind of, you know, the things that are going on in our lives at this time. So I'm actually going to see what the book says. So to connect with elves or the nature spirits, go into a quiet place in nature, especially somewhere that has rock formations and possibly water. Sit quietly, physically protect yourself, close your eyes and pay attention to what you feel. You may be surprised at what you experience. You may even see light orbs floating around you with your physical eyes or your third eye. See if you notice any movements or shadows around the rocks. Be open to receiving messages from them. When you're ready to go home, respect the natural environment by thanking the elves and the nature spirits. So pay attention to what you see and sense when you're out in nature, particularly when you are around rock formations. As wild as it sounds, you are being called to connect with the nature spirits and elves in your area. Respect the wilderness as a home for beings seen and unseen. This card suggests that someone doesn't want to be disturbed. Respect their space and let them come to you. So a nice energy for us today. So taking time out in nature and connecting with the elementals, the nature spirits can really be beneficial in helping us to see and feel all the goodness that Mother Earth has for us. The theme that has been coming up from the beginning of this year has really been about taking care of our bodies, healing, using natural resources that Mother Earth has to offer, offer us, and treating our body as a whole being. So rather than just treating any ailments, treating your mind, body and spirit is going to be far more beneficial in helping you to alleviate any issues or problems, pain, whatever it is that, that you've got going on around you. This is definitely a time to look at author, alternative therapies. So perhaps um, using Reiki, um, herbalism, uh, shamanism, all of those different things are going to be far more powerful than um, traditional medicine, which just treats the symptoms rather than the body as a whole. Now, this has been coming up in my free readings. This has been coming up with personal clients as well. So we're really being asked to pay attention to what we feed our bodies. So not just nutrition, but the images, the beliefs, um, and all of those different things. So paying attention to diet, of course, is really, really important. So really pay attention to what you're doing with your body nutritionally. So what you're putting in your body. Not everybody can tolerate the same food groups. So if you have um, you know, different ailments and things like that, perhaps look at the food groups that you're eating. Maybe one of those needs to be eliminated. 
exercise, drinking lots of water is coming up right now. We're going through a really big cleanse. So cleansing out as much as we possibly can, especially negative, stark, stale emotions. So drinking lots of water is going to be really, really helpful for you right now. I'm really looking at um, the cleaning and clearing that you can do of your body through um, detoxing, through eating the right foods, and through using therapies that treat your whole body is really, really important. So that's a message that comes up a lot in my group readings and personally with my clients as well. So do take the time to have a look at what you're putting in your body because we are what we consume. So if you're filling body, filling your body with unhealthy foods, then you're going to see issues. But if you're also feeding your body with unhealthy thoughts, habits, behaviors, um, images, beliefs, all of those things, then your body's going to start to react to these things. Okay, so if you want to know more about that, then please feel free to reach out to me. So I'm going to take you through a fragmented soul activation today that is going to call back all parts and pieces of your soul that have been left across time and space, people and events. When we lose parts of our soul, we can start to feel not whole. We can start to feel that there's parts or pieces of us that are missing. So it's important to bring these pieces back to us to help us to feel whole, feel centered um, and feel aligned with our mission and our purpose. So do turn off any distractions. Of course, if you're driving, you don't want to be doing this meditation while we're driving. So if you need to come back to the meditation, then do so when you can be fully present in the moment as we are going to open your Akashic Records and we are going to call back all missing parts and pieces of your soul. So just take a moment to close your eyes. I'm going to take in three really nice deep breaths. We're going to breathe in and call back our energy from across time and space, people and events. And as we breathe out, we're going to relax and release. Then breathe in, calling back your energy from across time and space, people and events. And breathe out, just releasing and relaxing. Breathe in, calling back your energy from across time and space, people and events. And breathe out, just releasing and relaxing. And I'd like you to bring your attention to your heart center. And just imagine that you are breathing through your heart center. Just see your heart center expanding. See a beautiful golden thread come down from your heart center, down through your body, into Mother Earth, all the way down until you reach her beating heart. Feel the connection between your heart and her heart. Bring her energy up through your golden thread back into your heart. You're fully connected to Mother Earth, heart to heart and consciousness to consciousness. Now see a beautiful golden thread travel up your body from your heart center, up to your crown chakra, out through your aura to your higher self. The golden thread connects your heart to the heart of your higher self. And you create this heart to heart connection. The golden thread of light travels higher and higher into the universe and out to the multiverse. Connecting to source energy the golden thread connects your heart to the heart of source and connects you consciousness to consciousness and heart to heart. 
Source energy travels down the golden thread all the way back down to your heart center. You are now fully connected to heaven and earth. Just taking a moment to give me access to your Akashic records. You don't have to do anything, just say yes in your mind. We're now gonna call in the Archangels to support you today. We're gonna call in Archangel Metatron, the Archangel of Ascension and Transformation. We're gonna call in Archangel Ariel, the Archangel of Mother Earth and the Cycles and Rhythms of Life. We now call in Archangel Michael, the Archangel of Protection and Life Path. We now call in Archangel Raphael, the Archangel of Healing. We now call in Archangel Gabriel, the Archangel of Communication, Ideas and Creativity. We now call in Archangel Chamuel, the Archangel of Love, of Unconditional Love and Self-Love. We now call in Archangel Uriel, the Archangel of the Mysteries of the Universe and your soul. We now call in Archangel Zadkiel, the Archangel of Life Paths and Forgiveness. And we're now going to call in Archangel Sandalphon, the Archangel of Soul Nurturing and Clarity. In front of you, you can see a large Merkaba. Step inside the Merkaba. Don't worry if you don't know what this looks like, your higher self knows exactly what this is. The Archangels take their place around you at their points of the Merkaba. All of the Archangels are here to support you today. We're going to call in the Fragmented Soul activation. This activation will continue to run this activation will continue to run long after this call and for as long as you need it. Divine Source, please activate the Fragmented Soul activation now for the highest good of all. The Fragmented Soul activation calls back all parts and pieces of you that have been left across all time and space and with people and events. We lose aspects of our soul at times of trauma, abuse, arguments, anger, unforgiveness and conflict. We also leave part of our energy behind with the people we have spent time with and the places we have been. See, feel and sense all of your missing parts, pieces and energy that are ready to return back to you. Everything has been healed before it returns back to you. Imagine, see, feel or sense all these parts and pieces of your soul returning to you. Feel the energy fill your body as this activation is installed. This activation will help you feel whole, centered and aligned, allowing you to feel all the parts of yourself again, feeling connected and present. Know that everything is being reintegrated now. You can now bring your awareness back to the chair that you are sitting in and the room you are in. Slowly open your eyes. your thighs to ground this healing energy in. I would love to know how you're feeling after this healing and activation so please feel free to reach out to me. If you would like to know more about clearing healing and activating inside of your Akashic Records then please do visit the website and check out the Akashic Alignment Portal. I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Have a fabulous week. Ciao for now.